do you speak so that people want to listen to you? Well, the key is you need to answer questions in the form of stories. Now, how do you tell great stories? I'm going to give you three elements that you can sprinkle into your stories. I call them storytelling steroids. The first key is you want to raise the stakes. How do you make the situation matter? Let me give you an example of that. We had to close this deal in just five days. Otherwise, we'd be forced to shut down the company. You're now thinking, did they even close the deal? What happened? The second key element you can add is what I call a conflict. And sometimes it's in the form of competition. For example, while we were close to discovering product market fit, one of our competitors swooped in to snatch our customers one month before we were ready to launch our product. And the third element you can add is internal monologue. For example, I couldn't reconcile why was it that I couldn't articulate my thoughts in just 10 minutes during a business presentation, but I could speak nonstop as fluently as possible when I was covering a basketball game for two and a half hours, completely unscripted. When you incorporate these aspects into your stories, you're creating unanswered questions in your audience's mind, keeping your audience hooked.